Welcome back everyone. I'll go and show you exactly how to turn off autocorrect on your iPhone. Now you may want to do this for a couple of different reasons, yada yada yada, you guys already know. What you want to do is you want to make your way over to your settings app. So you'll come into a panel like this. What you want to do now is you want to go down into general, which is right here, and then you'll see a couple of different options. But what you want to do is scroll down until you see this keyboard option right here. So what you want to do here is you want to go and click on keyboard and you'll see a ton of things that come up. Now what you want to do and specifically what you want to look at is right here where it says all keyboards. You want to disable this auto correction or enable it. You know, if you want to enable auto correction, you want to make sure this is on. If you want to turn off auto correction, you want to make sure this is off. And that's essentially the main thing you can do. Now on top of this, what you want to do, and this is probably the best thing you do at this point, is right here where it says text replacement, you want to go ahead and click on here and you want to make sure there's nothing already here that you've already done or whatever the case is that autocorrects to something else because if these are autocorrectable, so basically anytime I type in OMW, that means it basically translates to on my way. So if you also want these things to be disabled, then you're going to have to go over here, you're going to have to hold these down or whatever, and you're going to have to delete these and then move on from there. So that's another thing you're going to have to do and another thing you're going to have to remember. Now, there can be some times where for some reason the keyboard that you're using may not be, you know, up to date with these things. So what you're going to do is you want to click on your keyboards here. You want to find your specific keyboard. Let's say I use Gboard. You want to go ahead and find out the keyboard name and you want to open up the app of that specific keyboard. Now, this is probably not going to be useful for anybody, probably not for most people watching this. So for this example, I have Gboard right here. And you want to open up the app settings and you want to go through here and find any specific auto correction settings here. So there's probably some, as you can see, auto correction. You want to make sure this is disabled here too if you're using a third-party keyboard. But if you're using an Apple keyboard, you probably don't have to deal with that. So that's essentially it. If you guys have any other questions or anything, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would mean so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out till then.